So, continuing on the custom card review streak, we're going to be talking about a Spider-Man card. Definitely a first. And it's coming in from our guy, that boy, Crippin. Shout out to Crippin over in the 24-7 Discord server. You guys should join it. Link down below in the description for you guys to join today. Send me custom cards over to BHDF Custom Cards at gmail.com so I get to your custom card as soon as possible. I'm getting all these recent custom cards out of the way. Guys, I am on a very very strict time limit right now so i have to just go straight into the card there's not really a message inside this email besides uh where he um sent the uh document from so with that being said friendly neighborhood hero tur super str makes sense because of course red is the dominant color inside of a uh, spider-man spider-man well inside of his costume that being and there goes the image very dope um ost i am not playing that ost respectfully Griffin, because brother when i play osts other than Dokkan OSTs, or it has to be like from like a video game or something. I'm not even gonna take the chance. I get hit with copyright strikes immediately when I play anything that's like other than like a video game or like anything that's outside of like a video game OST. They hit me quickly and immediately, so I'm respectfully gonna skip over it. So leader skill is a super glass three key and one 70% across the board. And the 30% of the stats is to earth red fighters or defenders of justice. And this interest animation activates entry animation at start of characters attacking turn when there are six or more super class allies on the team. So you just need a full super class um, led team as well as all allies getting two key and 32% attack and defense when HP is 70% or more. So very easy for this card to get off. You just have to have a full super class team and you have to be able to issue thrush, which you're going to be above the HP thrush at the start of the turn so the all allies just getting free uh support can't beat that and it's passive uh six key and 162 percent attack and defense in the start of the turn he has a 70 percent chance to dodge when hp is 70 percent or more and he has a 50 percent chance to dodge when hp is 69 percent or less okay and he gets an additional six percent chance to evade enemies attacks including super attacks of course and an additional 19 percent attack and 15 percent defense per attack evaded within the turn so nice he builds up dodge attack and defense within the turn when he's dodging he also gets 162% defense before receiving an attack. Nice. And he has 162... No, that's not 162. I read that as 162, excuse me. Because that says 62% uh, attack when performing a super attack. I completely overread that. And launches three guarantee supers when HP is 70% or more. Each of which that have a 50% chance of becoming a super attack. What? It says launches three additional super attacks. When HP is 70% or more, each of which, am I crazy? Wait, 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 I'm reading that so wrong. I have to be reading that so wrong. Oh, wait. Yeah, no, I, I, I'm not. No, I'm not. Because that, that says launches three additional super attacks when HP is 70% or more, each of which having a 50% chance of becoming a super attack. I think he, huh? Uh, that says... Three guarantee supers. Okay. And launches three additional attacks when HP is 69% or less. Uh, if you wish I have a 30% chance of a super attack. Uh, huh? So he does a guarantee super. He does three guarantee supers. And after those three guarantee supers, he has a 50% chance of doing a another one? Okay. So I guess he launches his guarantee super, and then after he does his guarantee super, he has a 50% chance of launching another super attack after doing a guarantee super. Okay, I guess that makes sense. Uh, <laughs> it didn't make sense at first, but hey, we'll take it. Um, he also has a 62% chance to crit when attacking an extreme class enemy, and performs a guarantee crit, as well as 62% attack when facing a tech class enemy, and foresees enemy super attacks when HP is 70% or more. When HP is 69% or less, he gains 162% attack and defense. It launches two guarantee supers. And when HP is 50% or less, he gains an additional 162% attack for one turn. And he performs a guaranteed crit and launches a guaranteed ultra super attack once only, that being an 18 key super. Um, <clears throat> okay. So this card is basically um thriving off of hp restrictions you're above the 70 percent or more hp threshold you get a 70 percent chance to dodge um what else do you get you launch three guarantee supers and within those guarantee supers you have a 50 percent chance of those having an additional super attack chance 
And what else does he get above that 70% or more HP mark? He also gets foreseeing enemy supers. Um, and that's it. Yeah. Yeah, he gets a 70% chance to dodge. He foresees super attacks and launches three guarantee supers, all of which that have a 50% chance to come with super attack. That's what he gets when he's above the 70% or more HP threshold. When he's below the 69 or percent, 69% or less HP threshold, I said or percent. Oh my god, terrible reading, Dev. When he's below the 69% or less HP threshold, he has a 50% chance to dodge. He also launches three additional attacks that all have a 30% chance to come with super attack. And he also, what's that? He also gets an attack defense buff and performs two guarantee supers. So is he arguably, hmm, is he arguably, arguably better when he's below the HP threshold? Because think about it, right? When you're below the HP threshold, um, wait, no, that's when you're below 50%. No, 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 no. This, the 50%, you, that's when you get that attack uh, buff for one turn. Um, as well as that guarantee crit and, and, and you know, of course, 18 key super. Um, yeah, no, he might be better below that HP threshold. Yeah. Um, 50% chance to dodge, building up an attack and defense buff as well as additional dodge chance within the same turn. He'll be able to launch three additional attacks that have a, uh, hmm. He's looking strong. I'd say he looks strong. Looks good. Looks good. Um, I do like the design where this card looks good between two specific HP thresholds. I I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I just think it's a it's a dope concept. Like he gets and actually not. Nah, I might be tripping. He might be stronger above the HP threshold. No, no, no. He's he's stronger below it. Because he can get up to five plus supers, two being guaranteed. And yeah, two being guaranteed and uh, three being additional super attack chances yeah as well as a 50 percent chance to dodge and of course i already said the additional super attack chance um he looks strong above and below the hp threshold that's basically the point i'm trying to make and his active skill can be activated in when hp is 50 percent or lower and he gets 616 percent attack and evades all enemies attacks okay so he gets guaranteed dodge for one turn and 616 percent attack all right, and there was another YouTube link. Crippin, I'm sorry. I'm not having, no. No, no, no. Listen, Spider-Man, especially Spider-Man. Spider-Man is, uh, we're not going to go there. <laughs> His 12 key, he gets 30% attack for one turn uh, and has a 50% chance to stun. And his 18 key, he gets 30% attack for one turn. And 30% defense one turn, and he also has a 50% chance to stun or seal, or and seal the enemy. And his link set: shocking speed, brainy axe, cold judgment, prepare for battle, hero makes sense, fierce battle, and legendary power. In the categories that he's these on, uh, defenders of justice, I like to assume, because uh, there's defenders of, of and crossover, powerful comeback, worthy rivals, uh, um, earth breath fighters, bond of friendship, entrusted will, saviors, battle of wits, accelerated battle and all out struggle uh okay so i know i did rush this video and it's pretty much under 10 minutes right now but to some of this card this card is strong above and below the hp thresholds that the card is restricted to uh, i don't really watch hero movies like that so i'm i'm certain that this was the did spider-man did he fight the green goblin hold on um green goblin spider-man i think that's what he's trying to make a reference to if you're going up against a tech enemy and the green goblin is green of course um i think he's referencing that that's dope and i don't even watch hero movies i don't even watch movies like that like at all to be honest so me like peeping that out is kind of crazy because i don't even watch hero movies much at all uh the last movie i seen was dead man dead man oh my god dead Deadpool Wolverine 3, bro. <laughs> We're leaving that on the video. But yeah, um, W Car Crippin. This video was so botched, but I I gotta get this out because time restraints. But yeah, um, W Car Crippin, send the custom cards over to VHF Custom Cards at gmail.com so I get to your custom card as soon as possible. I'm getting all these recent custom cards out the way. Leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video, and that is all. Peace.